Hi, welcome to the second part of the Centric Basic Functional Training, where we will talk about the Decentric setup in D365FO. The main audience are functional consultants, developers, and key users. Let's start with Decentric parameters. When you install Decentric, you will find here under Organization Administration these last few menu items related to Decentric. But there is also a workspace, this one, and maybe the two most important links or tiles on this workspace are the centric report setup and the centric parameters. Let's start with the centric parameters. This is where the common parameters that are applied to all reports are configured, while here we have a report specific configuration. So let's start with the common configuration and let's really quickly go through it. Here on product tab we have what is the current product version and when was it released. Licensing, you will see what kind of a license you have and until when does it last. This is the place where you configure some common storage options where the templates can be stored on file system in case you have on-prem then it will need to be a network shared folder or on Azure or SharePoint. And by the way, templates can also be on AOT, but uh, to come to AOT, they need to be stored as AOT resources in some model. And then by building that model, they will come to AOT and you will be able only to refer to them. That is how, for example, the centric replicas will come to you. These are for some advanced emailing scenarios. Different setups for different print destinations, something for the screen, for file, several improvements made to printer print destinations and uh, different setups related to that. Print archive, we are exposing you and allowing you to configure which document type to use for archiving because otherwise you don't have a control of what D365 will do. Security, who can do what in the centric some diagnostics and document routing. These values are hard coded in the application, but we expose them to you. So that was really very, very fast overview of the centric parameters. But generally speaking, from the product page, you have a link to our manuals and they are full of useful resources. So we recommend that you refer to our manuals and that you get accustomed to them and that you know what uh, is written there. With this, we finished a quick overview of the centric parameters and we will continue with the centric report configuration.